I just want to start with uh, congrats on being part of a show that has uh, Taylor Sheridan invo involved because everything he touches turns to gold. Um, can you sort of talk about what what do you think it is about Taylor's writing that resonates with so many people? Well, this is kind of a hybrid show because um, Taylor and Terry Winter both did the pilot script. So it's kind of a great combination of the Taylor ethos of the West and manly men and danger and family. But then you have Terry, who's got more of a New York sensibility, and you have Sly, who brings some humor to it. So it's kind of an interesting hybrid, which works with the fish out of water story. Exactly. You know, I was going to say, that's one of the things I found with the episodes is that um, it can be serious at times, dead serious. And at other times, it has a really fun tone, which is unusual for, I, I wasn't expecting that. I think in any good show, you if it's a drama, you would have comedic elements to it. Like Sopranos could be hysterically funny. Um, yes. And I think you'd want that, you know, to have both those things. You want anything that's... Like life. Like life, you know. I mean, uh, life is a comedy that ends in a tragedy, as they say. <laughs> <laughs> True. <laughs> the worst the worst part is that's dead serious dead dead accurate um i hate asking the generic question but because no one has seen the show yet what have you been like telling friends and family about your character um i just say she's a horse lady because um that's kind of like how we see her from the beginning you know she really likes horses but um as it progresses, there's more going on than we realize there. And there's maybe some uh, plotting going on that she's not what she seems. So it's like any great, you know, drama. It's not what you expect. Yeah. And uh, Armand is someone that knew uh, Dwight for decades. You know, uh, I used to work for Dwight. Um, I ran the sports book for the Invernitzi family that Dwight was a capo in. And he was always a very intimidating boss. Uh, he was he was Armin's boss, and uh, uh, Armin is responsible for for a murder that uh, Dwight commits that sends him to prison for twenty five years. And uh, now I'm living in Tulsa, sort of hiding out there. Um, my wife doesn't know anything about my mafia background, and uh, it all it all comes to pieces when Dwight suddenly unexpectedly shows up in Tulsa one day. And I can imagine he's only there to kill me because I've been looking over my shoulder for, for the last 19 years. Um, I don't realize that he's been exiled there to set up a, you know, a crew there and to, and to, you know, plant the flag for the Inuvitsis back home. I think he's there to kill me. For soon to be fans of the series, what do you think they might be surprised to learn about the actual making of the show behind the scenes? Huh. Behind the scenes, it was pretty much uh, a, a pleasure cruise. I mean, we had it was like a joy to be at work every day. I mean, it was really, I've been on a gazillion shows, so, you know, so was Dane, obviously. And like, this one was like really, the vibe was fantastic. Yeah, I got to say, it, it, was, it was very well produced. Um, there was no wasted time, you know, oh. yeah, because a lot of us would be in for, you know, the way they shoot shows now is, there's two episode blocks so that you could fly in for your two episodes and then fly out again. So it was, I was very impressed by that. I've never been on a show that was so well produced in that way. Yeah. We did two at a time. So the month one would be episode one and two. That was like in April with one director, with one director and one crew. And then, then the uh, three, four would be block two. That'd be a different director, a different, uh, not all different crew, but different, you know, different GP, you know, different department heads and stuff yeah. like that. On that note, I need to stop. I'm just going to say that uh, this is going to be a huge hit. Uh, congrats. <laughs> and, I mean, I, I, I know um, not even a question. Um, have a fantastic day. Thank you so much.